Sugar is a natural sweetener formed by sucrose crystals obtained from sugarcane or sugar beet. Currently, 16 million tons of sugar are consumed each year. Producing such large quantities of this delicious flavor is no easy task. But have you ever wondered how sugar is made? We visited a sugar factory to discover how sugar is made from sugarcane. 80% of the world's sugar comes from sugarcane, which is cultivated in tropical climates like Brazil and some parts of the USA, such as Florida, Louisiana, and Texas. The sunny climate is ideal for growing sugarcane, a type of plant cultivated in fields of up to 350,000 square meters. Sugar is produced in the plant's leaves through photosynthesis and stored as sweet juice in the sugarcane stalks. Once fully grown, sugarcane is harvested and transported to a sugar factory for processing. A regular lawnmower is not sufficient for this scale of work, but luckily they have the most efficient machines in the market. A multi-purpose harvester collects the harvest, its rotating blades cut the three-meter-tall canes, and the foliage is expelled back onto the field. The machine cuts the green upper leaves of the plants, and the robust sugarcane stalks are pushed forward by the base cutter rollers and cut above the roots by two large base cutters. The stalks are then fed into the harvester's hopper, cut into 20-centimeter lengths, while the leaves are separated by two blowers. The machine can harvest 60,000 square meters of sugarcane in a day, clearing the land for the next harvest and providing free food for the local fauna. The harvested sugarcane stalks are mechanically loaded onto trucks and transported to the factories for transformation into sugar. Each sugar mill collects 3 million tons of sugarcane per year. The harvested sugarcane is emptied onto a large conveyor belt at the factory. The first phase involves cutting the sugarcane into small pieces of about 15 centimeters before passing them through a series of crushers to extract as much sugar solution as possible. In a sugar mill, there are more moving parts than in most industrial installations. As the crushers move the sugarcane along, water is pumped in to extract the maximum sucrose. The resulting mass is rich in sucrose but contains rock and mud residue. To remove the impurities, the solution is filtered in a clarifier, where the temperature is raised to allow the residues to float to the surface for removal. To eliminate enzymes and microorganisms, the solution is treated with heat at 110 degrees Celsius. The next challenge is to turn the purified syrup into sugar crystals. The excess water is evaporated, and the concentrated liquid is pumped into a crystallization chamber. Tiny sugar seeds are added to the sucrose solution, and the sugar solution adheres to them, forming sugar crystals. However, these sugar crystals are mixed with molasses, a product that gives brown sugar and rum their color. To separate the two products, the sticky solution goes through a centrifuge, spinning at 1,200 revolutions per minute like a giant washing machine. The centrifuge filters the liquid through small holes in its drum, trapping the larger crystals. The molasses is pumped into tanks with a capacity of 11.4 million liters for storage. To store all this sugar, large warehouses are needed. Two warehouses, each with a capacity of 160 and 3,000 tons of sugar, produce 40% of the total refined sugar in the USA. When the raw sugar is cleaned and clarified, the final product is ready. 20% of the factory's production is brown sugar. They produce sugar for various uses, including industrial, domestic, retail, and restaurants. Sugar is packaged in packets for hotels and restaurants. An ingenious device fills 2,500 packets per minute without spilling a grain. Once the sugar is inside the boxes, it is firmly pressed or compacted to ensure proper arrangement. Then, a robotic arm stacks the sugar into bundles of 56 boxes, an automated machine seals the bundles with cellophane, ready to travel all over the world. Now that you've seen how sugar is made, we'd love to hear your thoughts. What surprised you the most about the sugar production process? Share your opinion in the comments below. If you want to know how gold bars are made, watch the video on your screen. Like the video if you have enjoyed it and share it with your friends. Also, subscribe to this channel by activating notifications to keep learning. Thank you for watching.